Off on the trek into the heart of the Never Never, the expedition is nearing the country inhabited by the real bad men of Australia, wild blacks who have never seen a white. Prehistoric beings sprung from a race said to be 500,000 years old, men who have not progressed one degree since the dawn of creation. The tribe posts a sentry to warn them of the approach of strangers. Something is underway. These ebony gods of the Australian hinterland seem intent upon keeping secret some century-locked custom. The Nagalia and Pintibi tribes are meeting on the sacred ceremonial ground of the former. The ceremony of the Panna is unfolding in all its barbaric glamour. It is one of the rarest of all ceremonials and is held to commemorate the evil customs of the Nana Nana Wati, devil people of gruesome appearance who, according to the folklore of these people, lived on the flesh of corpses, a rare type of the Pintibi caste far removed from the average conception of Aboriginal physiognomy. The Nananana Wati, although only characters of allegory, still strike respect into the hearts of these wild men of the outback. The decoration, you see, is eagle's down, mixed with blood, human blood. A nasty piece of work in whom nature has blended bestiality with simplicity. Now you will hear the actual weird, almost uncanny sound of the corroboree recorded by the expedition on an old Edison phonograph because heavy modern sound recording trucks could not penetrate the wilderness. 